my mask up and take it, 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 mask up and take it. What is going on ladies and gentlemen, AJ Good here at the House of Masks and today we are Mailbox monday in. I've got a couple packages here and a few envelopes and it is a beautiful Monday like I said. So we gotta do it. It's not a Monday, I'm lying to you, it's a Friday. I'm filming this in advance. I just, I had enough so I figured I'd go ahead and, and get the filming out of the way. Art is a lie, nothing is real. But yeah, we do have a couple things here so I am going to uh, grab some and we'll start with the envelopes like we always do and we will go in order from smallest to the largest packages. So uh, first envelope is from James Antonson and uh, it's got an Elmo stamp on it so that's pretty cool. Let's go and see what's in here. We've got a small drawing and a note and the note says, Dear AJ Good, my name is James Antonson. I am 12. In the past year I've gone through some really hard things. A few of the people I really cared about passed away. When my best friend introduced me to Slipknot, they have been an amazing stress reliever to me and I love their music. When I found your channel I found a new passion for math and even bigger passion for Slipknot. Thank you for helping me through these rough times, James Antonson. Hey, thank you for the kind words. And here is a tiny little fan art. We've got the new nonogram and an I Hate AJ Good, of course. So I'm sorry to hear about all that rough stuff, but I am happy to help get you through it. And if my videos do that, then that's fucking rad. Moving on, we have another little envelope here from Bryce Luna. And I'm disappointed because there's not an Elmo stamp on this one. All right, let's see what we've got. Okay, dear AJ Good, this will be my first letter of many. I have found your channel on YouTube to be quite amazing. First off, your collection is kick-ass. Can't believe you have time to make your collection so big in such little time. I used to listen to Slipknot back in the day, and now I have found a passion for them again, thanks to you. Their music helps me get through the hard times, and I thank you for bringing them back into my life. I now have started a collection. My first mask that I will be unboxing is a .5 Corey Taylor from Samuel Dean. Good fucking choice. If you wouldn't mind shouting him out, I would appreciate it. P.S. I am very sorry for my spelling. Check back. I hate AJ Good. I think Samuel Dean has had more than enough shout outs on this channel because all of my point fives except for one is by Samuel Dean. So every single one of those that I did a video on featured Samuel Dean's. But I appreciate the kind words and I'm glad to see you get into collecting. And uh, Samuel Dean point five Corey is a great start because those are hands down my favorite and in my opinion the most accurate of the point five Corys available. So have fun with it. Okay, next up we have a slightly larger envelope. This one does not say who it's from. So let's go ahead and and open it up. I want to make sure that I don't cut the contents. Feel stickers. Oh snap, I know what these are. I'm sure that everybody has seen these too. Okay, so what we have here is the full set of the Mark Nosler stickers. I know that a lot of you guys saw this stuff floating around on Instagram because I saw a shitload of it, not only on Mark's page, but just a bunch of places were sharing it, and these are fucking rad. The clown is even holographic. Super, super cool. Definitely an art style of his own, like unmistakably Mark Nosler, so that is fucking rad. Thank you very much, sir. And then we've got some Mark Nosler cards here with some illustrations on the back. Of course, I'm gonna show all this to you guys at the end up close and in detail so you can take a look at it, but I will definitely link Mark's Instagram down in the description so you guys can go check him out because these are fucking sweet and I'm stoked about it. Thanks Mark. Alright, next up we have a box and this is from Mike Black and he even decorated the box unless he received the box like that and just forwarded it to me but I'm pretty sure he probably decorated it so he went the extra mile. No biggie. Alright, let's see what we've got. Alright, I see a note first off. It says, what's up, AJ? Here's your custom I hate AJ good buckethead bucket. Oh my god, we're getting new buckets. If you follow me on Instagram and show off my stuff, I may send you some more sweet-ass shit like this. Also, give a shout-out to my good friend Kuma Kess from KumaKess.com. He's a sick-ass musician, songwriter, and deserves to be heard. Please, love and tits. Oh, it says peace, love and tits. I'm an idiot. Mike Black of Mike Black's Art. Instagram at Mike underscore Black's underscore Art. And Facebook, Mike Black's Art. And then there's a photo of Michael Jordan, and it says, my Michael Jordan portrait. Felt appropriate to throw this on. Oh shit, that, that is art that he did. Okay. I thought that was a real photo there for a second, but that's actually a painting that he did that's fucking phenomenal. Well, I can only assume that the bucket is going to be epic, so yeah, let's, uh, let's check it out. I see blood. All right, so I see some blood. Oh shit, it's painted all over. The front of it's painted. Sick! 
It's a big middle finger. It's perfect. And it says, I hate AJ Good up here. I don't know how well you guys can see that, but it's fucking epic. And it's all stitched with like old yarn. And we've got bloody Colonel Sanders on the back. Well, that's fucking epic. Definitely the coolest bucket that we've received so far. So, uh, yeah, that's fucking dope. All right, well, I don't think a shout out is going to be too much to ask for because this bucket is awesome. I guess if you ask for buckets, you will receive them. Well, hell yeah, man. I appreciate it. This is a uh, super fucking rat. I can't wait to display that. All right, we've got one more box here, and this is from, I, I cannot read, um, Oliver. It's from Oliver. So let's see what we've got in there. All right, we've got a note. Please excuse the chicken scratch I call handwriting. I can't even read what I write sometimes. I've been watching your channel since last fall, and I love watching everything from the unboxings to the Mailbox Mondays to even the speed paints on masks. I discovered your channel through your mask thrift store hunting videos and was happy to find a YouTuber with similar tastes in music and movies. I love Slipknot, Ghost, Halloween, and especially Buckethead, and your videos got me into actually collecting masks and memorabilia. I made Buckethead a custom fan bucket in May, and I wanted to do the same for you. Oh my god. God, we got another bucket. I had made a fan bucket and two masks I converted. I don't have a lot of materials to work with and would love to sculpt my own masks in the future, but right now I am experimenting on whatever I can find. Thank you again for inspiring me and producing great content. P.S. Thank you for featuring my fan art a few weeks back. It made my day. My Instagram is at the.wild.hill. Hell yeah, your art is rad. And there's even a tiny AJ Good portrait on the notes. So that's fucking sick. And I genuinely can't wait to see this bucket because buckets just make me really really happy now. Like, ever since I received that first, like, fan art bucket, I've been over the fucking moon, so. I don't know if it's gonna top this big fucking middle finger one, though. Alright, first up, we have a mask, and it looks fucking sick, actually. It's like a hockey mask, but burlapped over with some teeth showing, and for someone that says that they don't have the materials and stuff, uh, you sure don't seem like it, because it's pretty fucking good. Like, you could sell these. Like, people would definitely, definitely buy that. All right, I see another mask. I'm gonna have to set this box down without making a big mess. It's a green screen. Yeah, I fucking wish it was a green screen. Okay, so uh, we've got like a like a bloody bandaged up patient there with a sideways zipper mouth. Dude, you could sell this stuff. People would, would definitely pay for this. I see other people selling stuff that's not nearly as cool, so I definitely think that you could uh, you could sell these. This one is is crazy cool. Okay, he said two masks and a bucket, so I believe the next thing we're gonna pull out is a bucket. And the top of it already looks sick. Holy shit dicks. Wow. Wow. Dude, that's fucking sick. I can't even explain like how cool this is. Everything on it is rad. And I had just said something about like beating the bucket that I already pulled out on this episode. Holy shit. Yeah, that's insane. That is, uh, you guys are definitely going to have to see this like up close because it is wild. Okay, so there's unmasked me, masked me, bucket head with my props, Papa 2, Slipknot, Harold, Michael Myers. It's like everything. My mask up logo. Pretty fucking epic. So, uh, yeah, I think that's it. Let me scour these packages real quick and make sure that I didn't miss anything. Alright, I think we're good. So, uh, yeah, this was a pretty epic episode, man. These buckets were fucking sick. The masks are cool. I got some Nostler stickers and people said nice things to me. It's like a perfect Monday, even though it's Friday. And art's still alive. Nothing's still real. It's Monday when you guys are seeing it. That's all that matters. So, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and lay all this stuff out and let you guys take a nice up-close look at everything. Genuinely happy for all this stuff. This is, uh, super fucking rad, so. Thank you very, very much to everybody that sent in. I definitely appreciate it. And thank you to everybody that's going to send in. If you would like to send in, as always, I'm gonna add my shipping address down below. And if you guys keep sending stuff like this in, then the future of Mailbox Mondays is in good health. So, yeah, I, I don't even know what else to say. I just want to show it off to you guys, because this shit's so cool that, uh, it deserves to just be seen. So yeah, one last thank you to everybody for sending stuff in. Majorly, majorly appreciated. If you can't send something in and you'd like to support the channel in other ways, we do have a Patreon. You guys are more than welcome to go sign up over there. Not gonna beg for it, but you do get cool shit if you do sign up, so keep that in mind. You're not just donating your money. There are transactions. And if you guys can't do that, then you know the regular YouTube stuff. You can like, share, comment, subscribe, whatever the fuck you want to do. Once again, not gonna ask you for it, but I'd greatly appreciate it if you did it. So that is going to be it for this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed watching and until next time, we will see you later.
quite literally the fuck it bucket.